Welcome back, Yancey Crew. Get ready to unwind and relax with me while I show my college night routine. I had such a busy day today. I had to work 8 to 2, class at 2.30 and 4. So I just got out of the class and your girl is starving. So I'm headed to one of the best restaurants in Dekka. Red Bone, a hibachi restaurant. I deserve a good meal after this long day. So now I'm headed to Westco. Yes, Westco look a little bit ghetto, but your girl wants some to drink and some of her favorite snacks. So I got some of my favorite juices since high school. They're only a dollar, so make sure y'all go try them out. I also grabbed me some cookies and airheads for later. Airhead and airhead bites are probably my favorite candy. Now y'all, let's get into this food. Oh my God. If y'all know me, y'all know I love some good eating. And your girl about to smash this. This is probably my second meal of the day. Usually when I get food, I sit in my car, I write, I watch a show or eat with my boyfriend. But today I just decided to eat and get a peace of mind because lately I've been overwhelmed with a lot. So now, it's finally time to head to my room. But before anything, the girl have to clean up. This morning, I left my room in a mess trying to get ready for work. So I don't know about y'all, but having a clean space is very relaxing and important to me. Y'all about to see how messy my room is. Look. Mm -mm. After a long day, every day, I love to take a pause and look at myself. Because to look in the mirror and feel happier about yourself is confidence. And confidence is, it's priceless. So now, as y'all can see, your girl is rolling up her hair. Because this wig about to come off, honey. I gotta clean. I gotta relax. I gotta shower. So yeah, baby girl gotta go. <laughs> Let me show y'all the mess I made. Like, it's not much, but it's something. So, your girl gotta put everything back in place. Plus, I think this week we have room inspections. So, I always try to keep my room decent because you never know when them RCMs and RAs are coming. Sis, when you cleaning, light your candle. I feel like it's at the perfect mood, the perfect tone. And plus, it gives this fresh, good smelling scent that you need. So yeah, never clean it without lighting your candle. better 10 times cleaner and i'm that girl that loves wearing my boyfriend clothes so yeah it's time to get in the shower now yes it's you that period <laughs> so i don't know about y'all but to set the mood for a good shower you always have to play music like i love playing music when i get in the shower it's just a whole vibe can't y'all tell <laughs>
<laughs> if you watched in my previous video, um, the hygiene haul video, then you will see a couple products that I'll be using from that video today. So I first, I start off with my bar of soap, sensitive dove soap. I feel like every woman should start off with a bar of soap before you use body wash. Now I'm going in with my body wash, the Dove Pampering. Y'all, I actually love this scent. It smells so good. Yeah, I know I can forget about my favorite sugar scrub, Moroccan Rose. I think I'm saying it right. So when I get out of the shower, you know, you're all clean. So I try to go ahead and do my facial routine. So at night, I wash my face with Cetaphil Cleanser. I feel like it's very good for my skin. I have very sensitive skin and I've been using Cetaphil for about a year now or two and it's been working perfectly fine on my skin. So when washing my face, I always try to use a white towel. Um, I was watching this video one day and they basically was saying how the dye and the color from the towel can sometimes cause you to break out and different things like that. So. I always try to use a white towel plus I like using a white towel because I can see how much dirt is on my face and how clean my face is so I highly recommend a white towel when you're doing your facial routine. So now I go in with my witch hazel. Um, this is probably the only witch hazel I use. I've been using it for over three years now and it works perfectly fine for me. And I also used the little circle pads from Walmart. I think they're like $2. So after the witch hazel dry, I go in with my Cetaphil lotion to top it off. Keep your skin good and moisturized for the night. And honestly, y'all, I do this for my night and morning routine. The only difference with my morning routine, I use sunscreen. So now let's get into these new tools that I brought. Y'all, so this is basically a roller, a facial roller. And I was watching TikTok, so yeah, TikTok definitely made me buy it. But I feel so relaxed. I do believe the purpose was to reduce puffiness, brighten your complexion, even though I highly, you know, don't believe that. But it's definitely giving spa vibes. It feels so good on my face, y'all. I highly recommend y'all to go buy it. Even if y'all don't do it to yourself, I'm pretty sure having somebody else to do this to your face will feel so relaxing after a long day. I also got the Gua Sha Stone. Y'all, if I had to pick between the Gua Sha Stone and the roller, it would definitely be the stone. Like, it feels amazing i'm definitely gonna have to get my boyfriend to do this when i have headaches but it say it's the purpose of it is to relieve tension it's other purposes but the main reason i got it is to relieve tension on my neck because i have knots in my neck and y'all it feels so relaxing like i'm telling y'all go to y'all nearest walmart and get y'all one right now right now sis So as my body continues to air dry, I didn't set my clothes aside for my internship in the morning. I have a paid internship, y'all. So yeah, y'all see my cute little setup I got, boss lady in business, yeah, period. Um, well, now I'm going back in to moisturize my skin using a Dove Pampering Lotion. Y'all, this is something new. They just got this lotion in, so you know your girl had to dry it. And I love the way it feels on my skin. I love the glossy look it gives as well. It feels so good. Highly recommend the Dove Lotion. Your girl can't forget her deodorant. Um, I'm using Degree, but y'all, I'm actually going back to the store to get me some Dove because Degree is really not my favorite and I really wanna try some more Dove products. So now that I done got all settled, I decided I wanted to rent me a movie. 
And I saw this movie, I think, on Facebook. My boyfriend showed it to me, Equal Standard. So I bought it, rented it for the night. And I also just got a new projector, y'all. Also, TikTok made me buy that as well. So it's only $50. Y'all go get y'all a projector. As y'all can see, it's good quality. And yeah. So yeah, now that I got me something to watch, I'm probably finna warm up me something else to eat or even pop me some popcorn, brush my teeth, and call it a night. Your girl is tired. Your girl is overwhelmed. She had a long day. So that wraps up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my college night routine. If you did, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below more content you want to see and subscribe to your girl channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.